Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I started about a year ago doing some altered spiral bound notebooks and um, pardon the southern accent but when I get real tired it comes out. Anyway, I didn't finish any of them because life and health got in the way. So for the last three days I have actually been working on this one and it was halfway done. But this is kind of like a flower garden botanical theme. And I just have some ribbon for a lace closure. Some um, little delicate lace on the outside. And a um, journal card on it. It's covered in purple construction paper with all of this on top of that. And you open it up. And I have the Init One ticket that I bought from a digital kit. I have a tag and a big pocket. And a little tab here that I had made. Just put some little lace down the side. And this journal has the black and white edge on it already. I didn't spill every page because the more I'm into journals, the more I'm thinking I like the plain look. I like having writing space in them. So it's not a junk journal because it's not full, but it's just a writing space journal. And here I just put a little card in, made a tuck spot, and a little tag with some tickets on it with some botanical. I have been buying a lot of digital kits. So I have a lot of digital kits that I'm working with. Just put a little card on each one. Here's another pocket with a little journaling card inside. And you probably, as you go through, you'll see digital kits from different people mixed together because I buy a lot of digital kits. And I've started making some myself. And I'm sorry, but I've been working with fabric tack and it's all over my hands. So it's just a simple little journal. Um, I put a journaling card actually in here so there's a lot of extra writing space on this one. Little pocket with a tag. The same here. And then here's the new section. And I put all of my um, you, there's a video somewhere up here. I put all of my dividers in <laughs> about a year ago, actually, and then just started again. And here I just put a sleeve of long tickets in. Another just a little tag I made. It's a very simple, plain journal with tons of writing space in it. And these were some tags that were free in one of my groups. And I turned them into tuck spots. And here's another digital kit that I had purchased off of Etsy. And I just put the little cards in here for journaling cards for extra space because these tags did take up right much of the page. And that's another digital. Hmm. And basically I'm just going to flip through it because there's not a lot of description to it as you can see. I just And these are just glued down, they're not tuck spots. Just to decorate the page and it's blank. I like the cleanness of a writing space journal. And these are some more digital that I purchased. And a lot of the pages I just decorated. 
Here he's got some um, journaling cards in the pocket. A postcard with some tags. Paper doily from a kit that I bought, and these are actually <coughs> folded sheets of another digital. I buy most of my kits from Shabby Dabby Doodah, but I have been buying lately from other people as well. And here I just used the piece that I had left from a page and put some uh, belly band on it and tuck some um, different size little journaling cards in it and so forth. There's some tickets in a pocket. Too, I figured if you know whoever buys it doesn't want to write on the cards, they will still have them. If they can use them for whatever they want to use them for. With another belly band with the um this is actually a digital journal page that I fold in half and inside the blank they can write on it. Blank. Here's another section beginning. I just put two pieces of two uh, things of tickets in it. This is a tag, but I made it a flip out. And the glue's kind of stuck. Sorry, I have glue everywhere on my hands and I'm trying not to get it on the book, so it's kind of hard to turn the pages. And it's basically the same all the way through, just pockets and tuck spots and dividers and, you know, some pages are blank, some are decorated in different ways. This is another flip out. I probably should have glued some pages together. <clears throat> Especially when I was doing like flip outs and such. But I just, I'm trying to finish up a lot of unfinished projects I have around here. And this is all blank. And then. I just laid down cords and you know, decorated some of the pages, some of my blank. And the very last page I have the um, Ultra Library card that has some purple flowers on it. And that's it for this journal. It is complete. So I'm very happy I got at least one of them done, even if it did take me three days to finish it. But I'm slowly getting back into having my strength built back up. Um, I am taking treatments for my immune system to build my immune system back up because I have been so sick for so long. But um, yes, yeah, it's, it's helping. It's giving me some, a little bit more energy. So, I just must stop ripping completely up when I was tying it. <clears throat> this is it. It's finished. Hey, if you like it, I hope it gave you some ideas, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.